I got nothing. I got no words for this introduction. The video we're going to be looking at today is so stupid and so bad, I can't even come up with an introduction. Hey YouTube, it's Kablame Bandicoot 64 Bandicoot Commentary, that kid dumbass. Or that kid Douglas, but you know, he's a dumbass, so we're going to call him as such. Oh boy, do I have a lot to say about this guy. Oh boy, well... You know, I, I used to actually like his videos, but then he made that abysmal video on me, and then I unsubscribed to him. And then he made that abysmal video on Clay Claymore, which Clay ROASTED! And then he made a follow-up, which in turn Clay ROASTED! And now I am gonna proceed to roast it. So, let's begin the roast! I brought the barbecue sauce. Banda Munchies time. So Clay Claymore finally responded to me, and I'm honestly disappointed because, quite frankly, he didn't do a very good job. Of course, you would be the one to say that, considering he ROASTED you. Okay, I'll stop saying ROASTED, but come on, it's pretty obvious that you're just upset that he made the video on you. That's the only reason why you're, you're not pleased with his video. It's because he attacked you, and rightfully so, because your video was shit. You rambled on over the same goddamn stupid nitpicky complaints over and over and over again, and he called you out on it. Okay? Believe me, there are plenty of commentaries on me that I've wanted to do commentaries on, but I haven't done so because I choose not to. Looking at you, DiCaprio DeLorean. I remember your shitty commentary on my Wii video. Yeah. But regardless, continue with the stupidity. He had all this time to come up with a decent response, and he still turned out something shitty. Now, as much as I would like to elaborate on how shitty the response is, as you probably expect, it's the same typical Clay Claymore shit that people have criticized a thousand times over. So restating it at this point would honestly be pretty redundant. Ha! Ah, you complaining! You of all people complaining about being redundant! That is hilarious. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at your Clay Claymore video. 24 minutes of you being redundant. My god. Now I know why he doesn't make videos on people that actually criticize him. I'll admit, I was legitimately wrong about one thing. Clay, maybe you should. In fact, fuck the maybe. You definitely should go after people that can't defend themselves. Yeah, Clay honestly should go after people who can't defend themselves, as clearly shown here. Yeah, there's a reason why he went after you twice. You can't defend your self-worth a shit. Because honestly, whenever you try to go after people that can defend themselves, you do such a shitty job at it that you make Kablam Bandicoot look like Leonardo da Vinci in comparison. I'm dead fucking serious. Well, thanks for the free advertising, but I personally prefer Picasso. And why me of all people? Don't give me any of that, why me, why me, bullshit. Your video sucked and he called you out on it. That's why he made his commentary on you. I, I'd really like to know this, why me? When it comes to critical analyzing, which is what ranters and commentators do, I'm not even the best at it. I'm nowhere near the best at it. I'm okay, but there's so many other people that are far better than me that made excellent videos criticizing you that you could have chosen to commentate on. So you just admitted that you're a flawed commentator? Yeah, that's why he commentated on you. you uh, your arguments were flawed, okay? Your arguments weren't that good. And so, Clay made a response because your arguments were not that good. God damn it, you just admitted why the fuck he made a commentary on you. You just fucking admitted it. You're not that good at making rants. There's a reason why he didn't go after those supposedly excellent rants on him, though I beg to differ on most of them. But there's a reason why. It's because they were all better than yours. Yours in particular sucked. And that's why he did the commentary on it. You just admitted this yourself. And instead, for whatever stupid reason that defies any sort of quantifiable logic, you decided that I was worth your time. Yeah, that unfathomable reason why he chose you of all people. I mean, it's simply unthinkable. Can you believe it? Your video was shit! And so he decided to commentate on that shitty video. Well, I just can't believe that. That is simply, like, there are a, that is so confusing. Like, oh, I can't believe it. Since you obviously don't seem to get it, let me say this. 
Don't ever pick a fight with me. Ever. Because you are going to lose. Wow, we got a real badass over here. Yeah, I don't want to mess with you. Don't ever try to pick a fight with me. I will whoop your ass. Yeah. Internet tough guy, ladies and gentlemen. The epitome of an internet tough guy. Believe me, I've had to deal with him. It's not my fault, nor is it the fault of the various people that have made videos against you, that people know how shitty you are. And as, and as, and as little as you like to believe, I'm not a hater. Bullshit. I'm really not. You don't actually have any haters, bro. Let's see, this is just going off the top of my head. There's Doodle Tones, Megadoop TV, Reaper, uh, Skeleton Nation, you. All of uh, you guys, by the way, failing to provide any sort of decent criticism against Clay Claymore. You just pretty much bitch and moan because your opinions are different from his. Yeah. Clay can be aggressive, but that's his style, and that's what he chooses to do. And that's not necessarily a bad thing. However, you guys take it too seriously when he's clearly trolling and trying to be funny while expressing actual criticism. Yeah, I'd say he does have a lot of haters. Hardly any of them warranted, though. And, 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 and some food for thought? Maybe if you weren't such a dick to everybody? Maybe if you didn't make shitty text-based videos filled with ad hominems and derogatory slurs? Then maybe, just maybe, the haters wouldn't criticize you as much. You know, there's nothing necessarily wrong with Clay using text in his commentaries. That's just what he likes to do. Explain to me, what's the problem with him using text-based commentary? Like, tell me this. What would be the difference between Clay using his actual voice and using text? He'd still be saying the same shit. Like, why are you complaining about the fucking... The fucking... Style. The fucking output of his commentaries. You're complaining about that. And apparently you're not the only one to do so. Like, are you people just running out of things to nitpick? I honestly feel like you guys are just going... Shit, there's not enough things to nitpick! Uh, text base, we're gonna go with that! But you're never going to do it, because you're too much of an egotistical fuckwad to even acknowledge that what you're doing is incredibly flawed. To be quite honest with you, I'm done with you and your nonsensical drivel, because all you've proven to me is that you're an oversensitive, egotistical, insecure, butthurt, petulant child. I'm sorry, but have you just never looked in a mirror in your entire life? Yeah, that part where you were complaining about him being ego egotistical? Oh, I'm just a nobody on YouTube. Why is Clay picking on me of all people? I mean me of all people. Yeah, that's totally not egotistical at all. Spoiler alert, yes, it fucking is. And you're getting this bent out of shape because I made a video criticizing you. Not just that. It's more so because the video that you made was garbage. And he wanted to give his two cents on it, and he did so well. You're the one who's butthurt. Your content is devoid of anything that you could, that could be considered you know, entertainment. It's devoid of substance, it's devoid of effort, it's devoid of entertainment, it's devoid of competent video making. Care to explain? I mean, they are clearly edited YouTube videos that he puts music into, that he puts his own cards into, that he puts his own subtitles into, um, you know. Do you care to explain how it's devoid of any sort of substance whatsoever and how it completely misses the definition of entertainment? Because I'd seriously like to know. I thought that if it's a YouTube video, then by definition it is some form of entertainment. You're entertaining yourself by going on the fucking website. But, you know what? Call me an anti-Clay Claymore hater all you want. You can cry on Twitter all you want about how mean I am and, and, and about how mean other people are because they criticize you. I fucking dare you. Wow. Clay, I'd be shaking if I were you. Don't you dare post anything on Twitter regarding Douglas. You know he'll throw some shit back at ya. Especially when he said he would never make another video on you ever again. He's done with you. you. You know what? I'm fucking done with you, Douglas. Screw off. You failed making a commentary on Clay, and you failed making a rant on me. Just stop. Just stop. I'm Kablam Bandicoot 64 and happy fucking holidays.
Ah, what do you guys want for Christmas? I don't know. I could go for a trip to the nail salon if I were you. No, you don't want to see my feet. At least toenails. Ugh, not good. But anyways, seriously, happy fucking holidays. I'll see you all in 2017. Hopefully the world will be a better place. World, if y'all are listening, improve.